ever the who athlete. Who is the Sterling Moss here? Here they go. They're sprinting, sprinting across. Young ladies Fantastic as well, as you stuff. say. So into it and pedalling away. It's a number 12 car. Stanley, number 12 car, the blue car, got the quick go away. So number 12 is Joe Stanley. Joe Stanley, number 12 in the pale blue no. car, leads as they go down. This is a distinct advantage for Joe Stanley in the number 12 car. He is head and shoulders. His little legs going underneath. The shadows of the tarmac reflecting the effort they're putting in here. Smoke coming off the tyres as Joe Stanley pedals and coming up behind it's a white car let's get a glimpse of the number Joe Stanley then heading for the chicane I can't see the number number, eight, number nine it's a single number eight, digit number it's nine it's three wide for third place through they go through there's a room through the chicane no collisions no contact but it's Joe Stanley who's coming hard in second place let's have a look it's a number eight or the number nine car it's either Callum McWhirter it's eight it's Callum McWhirter number eight Callum McWhirter in the white car heading Callum towards the line pedaling 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 it's going Callum McWhirter then alongside neck and neck Joe Stanley knows he's been beaten here he's been overtaken the blue car's got nothing left Callum McWhirter to number eight then towards the finish line the checkered flag is ready and it's Callum McWhirter brings it home Joe Stanley having led for three quarters of the race can be very tight for third and who's going for third let's have a look oh, it's a near two dead red cards fantastic oh brilliant brilliant stuff let's have so number... fourth place for number 11 which is Catherine Taylor Catherine and was Taylor. that red is that 68 that was just there or 63 <laughs> oh goodness me and but now they all come swarming through. This is a real test of endurance because, you know, they're pedalling away 19 to the dozen and out of the chicane, they're already starting you, to feel the burn. And you know what happens when you, when you sort of, uh, the, the momentum takes over the movement of your legs yeah. and you lose coordination. And then if you get out of the rhythm, then you basically you're locking the rear wheels, aren't you, as your, your legs get out of sync with the pedals. So what a fabulous feel. I mean, look at the number of these cars. Before the Goodwood Revival, when was the last time you actually saw a J40? It would have been very, very unusual. And right at the back is the clearing up car. There's a Land Rover coming back to pick up any waifs and strays. There is the number eight machine. That's the winner, Callum McWhirter. Fantastic late <laughs> burst of speed down to the line. Uh, Toby Moody is down on the grid. He's going to try and have a word with, with Callum. I uh, hope he's not a man of few words, Toby. Well, it's a fantastic race. I mean, it was, uh, it was a, almost a photo finish, but young man, you are a Goodwood winner. Well done. Thanks. What was your preparation for the race here this weekend? What have you been up to? Have you been testing, practicing? All of them. <laughs> All of them. What special tricks did you come out from testing with? Strong legs. <laughs> Strong legs. There's the good man. That's what you need. You have got your name in the history books, and you should be very proud. Well done. Thanks. Well done. You got your chocolate there as well, so you you got your rations. Did you did you go for the trophy or the chocolate? What was the target? <laughs> Both. There's there's the good answer. There's a good answer. Well done indeed. Joe, second place for you. What a brilliant drive. Thank you very much. What was what was your testing? were the results of your testing behind the scenes for this race? <laughs> Very hard work, but yeah, good to get second, definitely. Did you have a favourite road at home to test the car on? Yeah, hilly. <laughs> hilly, well that's perfect because it's nice and flat here at Goodwood, but you've got a superb trophy. That's going to be pride of place in your bedroom, is it not? <laughs> yeah. Well done, well done. Some fantastic job, fantastic job. And it was an absolute photo finish for third position. Harry, you're on the podium. Well done. Thanks. Does it, it, have you been nervous? Did you, did you go to sleep well last night, or were you a little bit difficult getting to sleep? Uh, uh, fine. You were fine? Yeah. Well, you can have a party tonight, because you, you've won a trophy here at Goodwood, and that's pretty cool, is it not? Yeah. Yes. Well, you're going to remember today for a long time, and hopefully you'll see this clip on the internet when you're, uh, when you're racing a big car here, and that's what's important. So you're the future of motorsport. You do know that, don't you? Yeah. Okay. Well done to all of our top three here in the Setrington Cup. Uh, absolute photo finish it was for third. Lots of atmosphere and chocolate all round for everybody.